CloudLight is a distributed system for real-time interactive graphics that computes indirect illumination in the cloud. Our ideal cloud hardware target is a GPU-enabled rack-mounted server, such as this NVIDIA GeForce grid unit. Inside each grid unit, you can see the dark squares of the two Intel CPUs and the silver rectangles of the three multi-GPU slots. We also extend our cloud with a GeForce Titan and a tower case because it is not yet available in a rack-mounted form factor. For the user, the cloud is invisible. He or she sees only the local device. We experiment with three system variants that target different local device capabilities. The Irradiance Map variant of CloudLight supports mid-range devices such as this laptop with a GeForce 650 GPU and Wi-Fi connection. The cloud computes dynamic irradiance maps for the entire scene and streams them to all clients using H.264 video compression. The clients then render their own final frames in the manner of current game engines. The Photon variant of CloudLight supports devices like this gaming desktop with a GeForce 670 and Ethernet. The cloud traces photons and streams them to all clients. Clients reconstruct indirect light locally and then render final frames. Photons require a more powerful local device but give higher image quality and reduce content creation cost. The Voxel variant of CloudLight can support even mobile devices like this iPad. The cloud computes both indirect light by voxel cone tracing and final frames, and then streams those to the client. The client is simply an H.264 video decoder with no local 3D rendering at all. Compared to currently deployed remote rendering solutions, such as Gakai and OnLive, this leverages the cloud to amortize the cost of rendering across multiple clients. We now show the client's view captured live in real-world situations. The following experiments show Old City with photons. They illustrate the perceptual impact of delayed indirect light as latency increases.